Yo, hello all my Pokemon trainers out there. It is your boy Pokemon Trainer J Lee. And we're gonna kick off our series of Pokemon Scarlet. This is episode one, Pokemon Scarlet, here on Pokemon Trainer J Lee channel. English is the language. Let's get right into making our character. And of course, our name is Jay Lee. Now this is my, I'll peel back the curtain real quick. This is my second attempt at trying to record a true Pokemon, or third attempt at trying to record a true Pokemon series. Initially, I tried to do uh, a Diamond Pearl and had audio issues. Then switched up to, um, Violet and again had audio and game issues. This one is where it needs to be. Not dropping any frames, nothing like that. That's a good eyes. What color contacts? What color should my contacts be? Purple? Purple eyes would be cool. Ultramarine. Lavender is cool too. Poppy Red. Gold. So many cool colors. Whoa. Total Dark. That's kind of cool too, actually. No, that's kind of crazy. Let's go with like either light pink poppy red or lavender let's start with poppy red I don't even know which ones I want. Uh, F. Let's go with F. Eyelash color. Let's go black. Eyebrow. Wait, eyebrow. Um, can't even see him. Where's my hair? How do you change my hair? I can't change my hair. Mm, I can't even see it. Let me find a smirk. Scroll to the bottom, see what I have. Um, no, that's a good one. Um, I'm looking for a smirk if they have one. They don't really have a good smirk. That one's nice. Oh no, no lip color. Lip color is, no. Yeah, no lip color. Um, I don't even know what the eyebrows look like is the issue. Let's go with like Beauty Mark 4, 7, 8. 
I actually like that one. And freckles. Hmm. Yeah, freckles like that. Okay. Looks pretty good to me. I can't really see the eyebrows. There we go. I can change my hairstyle. I should have maybe did hairstyle first then. Cornrows are fire. Short dreads is fire too. Let's go cornrows. Yeah, let's go cornrows. And let's make the hair golden looks kind of crazy. Dark brown looks cool. Platinum blonde, Super Saiyan blonde right there. No, 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 no. So hopefully this series will be exactly where I want it to be. Um, I can finally play through Scarlet Violet. I've never even finished a playthrough of this because of um. Ash purple is really kind of cool. Dark denim blue is nice too. I'm gonna go dark denim blue. Yeah, dark denim blue looks cool. Now I can go back and fix my eyebrows. There we go. I think those are the ones for me. Wish they had more options, but I like how they have them grouped up. But I think H is, yep, those are the best ones for me. Perfect. English, J. Lee, my style looks pretty fire. I like the eye color with the tie. The denim dark blue almost looks blackish, but it is a blue. I like this. Nothing too crazy, but still like create a character vibes. Enrollment application. Naranja Academy, I believe. I'm excited about this because, like I said, I've never completed either of these games storyline-wise. I got like a few hours in on my Violet only to realize the game was glitched. You know, like I was dropping frames, taking lessons from traditional, growing stronger and stronger, stronger and greater. Yeah, I was dropping frames. I was, audio wasn't the greatest, like... time for you too to dive into the world of Pokemon so I really have no true idea how this game even plays I don't know where to go nothing Dr. Clavo head of Naran Academy I don't even know if I'm spelling, saying that right Paldea is a sprawling region bursting with lush, natural, and magnificent landscapes. It's also, of course, home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. They reside here in great numbers, in fact. Panma or something like that? I think that's what that is. Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas and skies, even in our cities and towns. We humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. 
Naranja Academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners that hairstyle that person had. Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon to battle going alongside them. Look at that Tauros. Lamana. While our robust curriculum of coursework helps our students draw forth their fullest potential. It's within these halls that you will find your friends, your Pokemon, and your true self. We the facility and staff can't wait to welcome you with open arms. I can't wait to finish this game. Play through it, experience it. And the DLC is coming up soon in September. So my goal is for the rest of this month of August, play through Pokemon Scarlet so it can be ready for DLC when that drops. Let's go, camera. Okay, camera work. Yo. This looks beautiful. For a Pokemon game. This is nice. Can you dive in the water too? Or did you crash? Mm. Those little parrots with their little afro tops. Okay. Here we go. I'm excited. I hope all you Pokemon trainers are excited too. Let me know how you how you enjoyed your playthrough of Pokemon Scarlet or Pokemon Violet. I got the double pack, so I have both, but... And I love that the Joy-Cons there are the same ones I have. Like, it really is Scarlet Violet vibes. Let's get up. Whoa. I look cool. I look cool. Okay. So new Nintendo Switch system. This one's got a bigger screen. Oh, well, that's the new, new one. Not the new one that's coming next year, but the, uh, I don't even know what it's called. <laughs> Quidad Adventures. Same Mesagosa, a city that's home to a well-known economy. Oops, better get going. She built the shelves herself. Newly decorated with your belongings. Aww. Aww. Pokemon stickers on the wardrobe closet. That's cool. And some camera control, too. It's not ready to go. Not time to go yet. Wait. The bed what? It's soft, fluffy bed. It's got a lovely sun-warmed scent. I really am appreciative of how far Pokemon games have come. From being on your Game Boy to this. It's really cool. Some movement of camera is nice. It's limited, but still some movement is better than no movement. Yeah, I'm excited about this. Good morning, Jay Lee. Morning, Mom. Oh, already in uniform and everything. Well, it is your first day in new school after all. I'm so excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. School contact me and said you're supposed to be here for a little while longer. Their words, not mine. Something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Oh, wait, I hope we get right into getting our starter. Very thing we're waiting for. Get the door, would you? This ain't the door, is it? Out to the vegetable garden. Better use the front door if you want to go out. Watch out, screw it. Do 
do forgive the intrusion. Yeah, you just barged right in. Yes, Master J. Lee. On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. Uh, and also for my delay in introducing myself. I'm the director of Naranha Academy. You may call me Mr. Clavel. Clavel? The director? And you came in person to help my son with his first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including a f any failures on its part. So here, at last, are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Goodness, you really needn't have. You really needn't have. I don't know if needn't? Need not. Okay. Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? Ah, uh, no need to trouble yourself. Daily, I got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Just head back to your room, finish getting ready for school. you need your bag and your hat as well. I don't need that silly little hat. For a cuppa. Koopa? I don't even know. I think it was cuppa with two P's. Alright, let me go get my stuff. I got these high socks on. I don't want these high socks on. I don't want this outfit on. I want to change. First chance I get, I am changing up this outfit. Nice. Fresh bag. Hat's cool, I guess. The shorts are a little short. The socks are a little high. Okay, adventure guy. Press X button, open the menu. Oh, same old, same old. And I love that Pokemon games have very similar, like these, this, like the mainline games have very similar um, control setup. So once you played one or two of them, you have a really good idea. Oh, look at you already for your big first day. The uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Oh, please be the starters. I am excited because I'm gonna pick a different starter than what I picked on Pokemon and Violet even though you guys aren't gonna see that specific playthrough of Violet I can do another playthrough um, of it that you guys can't see but for now let's be Scarlet and because it's Pokemon Scarlet I have to keep it traditional with my starter when in doubt I always pick the same type so you'll see who the type is in a minute Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. Aww. They're all cute. Provide each student entering the academy a Pokemon of their own. I ask you to choose which one, which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, the cat, grass cat Pokemon. Smurr. For Coco, the fire quack. Croc Pokemon. Craw? And Quaxly, the duckling Pokemon. Pomp. They're all very good company. Why they usually refuse to even leave my side. Aww. What's this? So it turns out they're more interested in you, Master J. Lee, than familiar old me. I do wish I could stay and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off to my next home visit. I'll bet the house just over there. Take your time with your decision, then come find me once your mind is made up. Now, if you excuse me, until next we meet. What a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose just one, right? Not an easy task. Take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones and get to know them. They have lots to teach you. 
before you go, I got you a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going out on your own. Rotom phone, nice. Latest model. You can use to run all sorts of handy apps. According to instructions, open it with Y. Help me from get lost, take good care of your new gadget. Off you go. Thanks, Mom. Okay. I can just walk. I can't even fast walk yet. Aww. I already know who I'm picking. But I'm leaving the sp suspense up. Where are you going, Spurgatito? Hmm. <laughs> I love the way they move. Cabo Poco. Oh, here we go. Now I can run. See, and I love that they got rid of the run button. And you just have to hold it down. Walk. Run. Love it. <laughs> Alright, let's go choose which one we want. I'm guessing this is my rival's house? I think so. Whoa. Uh oh. Aww. <laughs> Sprigatino might be the cutest to me in the initial stage. Fue Coco has like this awkward cuteness. Are these threes trainers? Not quite. Master J. Lee has yet to make his choice, you see. The next step needs to be voice acted Pokemon games. Voice acted Pokemon would be great. I do wonder which of them he'll choose as his partner. <laughs> the choice is simple. The choice is simple. Buenas, we haven't met yet, have we? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. Hang on, Director, is this who I think it is? Academy's new student, Master J. Lee. He will be attending as of today. So you're that kid who moved in up the road. Dying to find out more about you. Namana? Namona? I can never say her name right. Normally I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Want to be friends? Sure. Love the enthusiasm. I'm going to get along just fine. Miss Namona... Is president of our student council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. Mm. I love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should battle right now, you and me. The two be in the same class, you have plenty of time to battle later. And get to know one another better, of course. We're going to be neighbors and classmates, so I have to battle all we want. On that note, Mr. J. Lee, please choose your starter. 
decided which of these Pokemon you like as your first partner. Do I even need to look at all three choices? Ever since I first played my first Pokemon game of Fire Red, I've always loved the Fire Starter. The Burning Heart Sparks that scatters will fry any and all plants in a flash. I'd like to go with a good Fire type Pokemon for a Coco here. Of course! Fire types always, man. Should I nickname Fue Coco? I would just name name him Fue Fuego, but I'll just nickname I'll just nickname him on on these videos. He's Fuego for short. Fue Coco, who gonna call him either Fuego? Just Fuego. Oh, look at Fuego on my shoulder. How can he stand on one leg like? Yeah, ever since picking Charmander, it's always been about fire types for me. This is your first Pokemon. Yes, please raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. Jaylee, I can't believe you actually chose for a Coco. I mean, like, where to make the perfect choice for you? You two make such a good combo. Of course, fire types always. Yeah, go ahead. Did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the academy? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at that time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Jay Lee while he raises his own new partner. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon equal footing with Master Jay Lee here, I shall be more than happy to allow it. Yes! She chose Spriggs. Nice to meet you, Spriggatino. Welcome to the team. Wait, where did she get them full length leggings from? Those are kind of better than the socks I got on. Now that we've chosen a Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. You may have noticed Miss Nimona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling. But I do hope you'll join her for a battle and I hope you get to know your Pokemon as well. Ooh, what's this? Potion. Roll on phone, popular item, yada yada. Using the map, you can find useful information. Move the map cursor. Over your own icon, move the right stick from side to side. Rotate view along with the map. Oh. You can use the left stick to move the magnifying glass around the map. Find locations. Select a location by pressing A, and you can set it as your destination. That's checkpoints. Cool. Check marks. Flying taxi service can take you to some places you visited before, places that you you can fly to or indicate it with a feather mark. Try taking a flight. So I can go back to my house. Like that. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nothing else down here but me and you. Alright. Let's battle. Anyone could be a trainer as long as they have Pokemon by their sides. It's our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon go stronger through battle. So you ready to battle me, Jay Lee? You know it. Perfecto. I'm super excited. For this battle, I think I'll use Miss Nimona. Use your starter. Just remember that Master Jay Lee is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. Eh, whoops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. She was about to try and clobber me with whatever them final evolution Pokemon. She, she likes to battle for sure. Come on, Jay, let's have a fruitful battle. Challenge by Pokemon Trader Nimona. 
Brigatito. Fue Coco. If we have Ember, it should be easy. If we have Ember, this should be easy. Yeah, yeah. But we're gonna be doing super effective damage. This should be a two hitter. You must have been studying up. Smart move. Fire is strong against grass. Come on, it's not my first. And we got you burned. Let's go. It's not my first radio. Oh, it's definitely a two turner now. Definitely a two turner now. I only did four damage with that. Level up. Yes. Got one whole level up. Perfect. She almost, she pretty much let me win. She pretty much let me win, which is fine, I guess. Winning your first battle ever. You got even more potential than I thought. Gonna be a strong trainer for sure, but now I want to try a strategy. Let's go again. <laughs> Just one more battle. St step in here. Quavo, Clavel, Master Jaylene is Freko are surely wary already from that last battle. Ah, uh, sorry. I got kind of caught up in all that excitement. I'm really sorry, Jaylene. Say to you too, Freykoko. Don't worry, we'll battle again soon. Oh, definitely. We'll definitely battle more. It seems like we're having friendly rivals. Is she older than me? But she's taller than me for sure. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing? I'm sure you can learn a great deal from a champion ranked trainer such as yourself. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me, since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you definitely need. Have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a sec. Pokédex! Nice, they're setting me all up in this first episode. Beautiful. Pokédex will automatically register any Pokemon you catch. It's a... Excuse me. It's a must-have for Pokemon trainers. Super handy app. A home teacher, Mr. Jacques, actually made it himself. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokédexes. It's quite the age we live in now. Oof, filling out a Pokédex by hand. I can't even imagine how much work that would be, that would take. I feel like that's a slight nod to Legends, Arceus, because that's where you're kind of handwriting, creating Pokédex. So that's kind of funny. And Oaks mentioned it before, Professor Oak, as well as other professors have too. Oh no, I suppose you can't. And yeah, no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. Exactly. No matter how the times have changed, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. Which is pretty relatable to current life. Like, it doesn't matter how many new, how many, how nostalgic you'll feel for the old games. It's a timeless pleasure to experience the new ones still. In my mind, in my opinion. And the more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard towards the goal of completing your own Pokédexes. Now, Miss Namon, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your partners. Or your parents. Could I depend on you to see Mr. J. Lee to the Academy? You'll be doing me quite the favor. Of course, leave it to me. I leave him in your capable hands. Alright, little ones. Time you and I wander away. Oop. Bye, Quaxley. Maybe we'll see you later. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with all my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokedexes, Jay Lee, you've probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the rules before I take you to the Academy. Come with me. Alright. Opening your Pokedex. Press the minus button. Open the Dex. You can navigate to your Pokedex by pressing Y from the map menu as well. Or oh, pressing X, excuse me. So this opens my Pokedex right up. Battle or catch Pokemon to compile file volumes in your Pokedex. Fancy your coverage for Pokemon you've caught. Open up your Pokedex to view all the volumes you've collected on a digital shelf and check out what rewards you can earn by pressing the X button. 
Quest of Plus, when looking at Pokemon, you've registered in your decks. You can check that Pokemon's habitat, learn more about where they can be found and when they're active. Explore different areas as you adventure and meet tons of Pokemon. Recently caught my Fue Coco. Here we go. The Fire Croc Pokemon. It lies on warm rocks and uses the heat absorbed by its square shaped scales to create fire energy. It's 21 pounds of weight, 1 foot 4 inches. Very cool. Aw, Coco's cute. Thank you all, Pokemon Trainers, for watching this first episode. Pokemon Trainer Jay Lee will be back with episode two, picking up right from this spot. Uh, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Catch you guys on the flip side. Pokemon Trainer, Pokemon Trainer Jay Lee is signing out. Peace.